Okay, I found kind of interesting thing. Like, I... I mean... Like, if you're just playing rhythm games, you just have to just shake your hands really a lot to make this... To make the keys just type like this. Like, you know. But this is with my right hand. And this... Is definitely... This is with my left hand and it's as you can hear it's kind of unstable but yeah so I just kind of figured out that my left hand's shaking speed isn't so enough so I kind of figured out like I kind of thought like what if I just place a book on this behind I mean under my left arm and then play the rhythm game and well yeah you get about yeah, you get about this kind of difference. I mean, yeah. I mean, I didn't really expect this to work, so... So, I kind of figured out why I missed pretty a lot on Jax. So, yeah, what I just need to do is just... Yeah, increasing my muscles. Yeah, increasing my muscles on the... On my left side of my hand. Let me just... Yeah. Yeah. The grasping power. My grasping power on the left is, as I remember, like about twenty, about twenty kilo kilograms, which is about. Well, should I really exchange it to pounds? I don't think I. I mean, is it? Yeah, it's pounds. So about forty-four pounds, which is very weak, and my right hand is about thirty pounds. I mean, no. 30 kilograms, which is about 66 pounds, so that's about like, that's like about 30% different, so that's why I pretty much missed a lot in rhythm game as I guess, so what I just have to do is just increasing the gr grasping power by, yeah, there are some kind of tools to it, like let me show you. Yeah, this one, it, yeah. I'm not sure exactly what is it called in English, but like this kind of stuff, you know? Yeah. And like, like few years ago, like, no, about last year, no, about two years ago, my dad just bought me to make my grasping power much, much stronger. Back then, I didn't really know why I should actually increase the grasping power because I'm not a... One, I'm not a person who likes sports and who does sport pretty a lot. I uh, no, I do like sports, but I don't do it a lot. But now I have figured out that grasping power might be related to the rhythm game performance. I'm not sure if shaking is related with the grasping power, but I kind of feel like it. So yeah, I kind of have to try the grasping, try to increase the grasping power and just tell you guys the results. And man, this this would be a definite. I mean, this definitely would be a really ex interesting experience. And if I like, I might just have to just do some research about this. About what kind of muscle do we use while we're playing rhythm game, and why are there some diff? Why am I having differences with the right hand and the left hand? Yeah, if I just figure that out, that would just help a lot on the newbies on the. Yeah, on the low rank rhythm gamers to make them enhance their skills a lot. Also, also the high rank players will be able to increase increase their skills pretty a lot because yeah, rhythm game is pretty much using muscles, and if we pretty much figure out what muscle we use and if we just train it, we our performance would definitely get better. Yeah. I thought like that, but one thing sure is that we do not know, I mean, I don't know how to actually figure out what kind of muscle do we, I mean, what kind of muscle do we use in rhythm game and how to actually figure that out, like, using some kind of machines or what. I kind of feel like I need to use some kind of, some type of machine, but I'm not sure, maybe I have to ask someone, but I don't know who to ask. So anyways, let's just get in. I'm not sure if I uploaded this, but yeah. Yeah, see? Like, even though accuracy kind of deep, accuracy kind of drops as I remember. Yeah. 
but I think about the accuracy you could definitely improve it because accuracy is about yeah precision so it's not about the muscles so you can pretty much control it so yeah I can't I definitely felt that my performance of the last left hand just increased really a lot there were some kind of patterns that I couldn't really do and I didn't really get it so smooth on this map but yeah yeah it was really interesting like I didn't really feel like getting I mean only putting a single hook behind like under my left hand increases my performance like see that was a really clean that was really clean like like 98 why the reason why I only why I got this down to 96 is because of the stamina and yeah stamina you just have to increase the muscle stamina and I also know how yeah I also know how so yeah I always have to train the muscle stamina yeah, without not by using rhythm games using actual muscle training stuff yeah so I just have to train my stamina with that and yeah and if I just train my stamina with that and then if I just train my grasping power I feel like I seriously feel like I could be better on the rhythm games much more better yeah just like this kind of performance yeah, it was a really interesting. Game. Yeah, it was really interesting. Maybe I'll just have to. Yeah, if I actually make this confirmed, I might just have to tell, make a video about how to increase winning game skills practically. Isn't that like a really nice idea? If it actually works, man, I kind of feel like it could actually work. Yeah, so. Well, I think it will take like a few months to work, a few months to work, but... Ah, uh, but the problem is... I need some other opponent to test. And if I... If, I mean, the opponent that I should test would should have the same skill as I do, and shouldn't really train the muscle. But finally... The person that has the exactly same skill as I do, that's impossible. So I'm not sure how should I just engage, how should I do the test? Maybe I'll just do... Maybe I'll just do six months of no muscle training and... Six months of muscle training and then compare those. Yeah, but I can do yeah. Maybe I'll just have to use that one, yeah. I hope it actually gets confirmed about the muscle. Yeah, if you just paint a specific part of the muscle and the wooden game skill in. I mean, how good is that? Like, by... Yeah. It doesn't mean that you own could just do some exercise while you could just literally exercise to just train rhythm games. Exercise like isn't that tiring than the rhythm game because in rhythm game you also have to see all those kind of insane notes. They also, you also have to see these kind of insane rushes of the rush notes. So they, your head kind of gets tiring too. But about the exercise, your head doesn't get tired. It's only your body. So I think that would be really good. Yeah, I just did like that. So I see some kind of bats. Yeah, some kind of bad. Yeah, some kind of bats at the middle of the 300 and yeah, 300 and flawlesses. Uh, I'm not sure how to just yeah. I'm not sure how to actually just decrease that or what, but still, this result is still amazing, and the method that I kind of use for this is worth trying. So yeah, if you have some kind of specific hand pot which actually lacks the hand speed or what, try to just yeah. If you, I mean, if you just 
specific hand is lacking the shaking speed, as I say, shaking strength, then the other hand, just try to put a book behind, I mean, below the hand that you, below the worst hand. Yeah, so, yeah, I hope you try that, and if that works, if that actually works to you, just please tell me, because I, yeah, if that actually works for all of you, it means that it's also confirmed, so, yeah. So anyways, yeah, that was the interesting discovery and the res and yeah, on the and the clue to it, I mean and the evidence to it, which is a really cool gameplay as I guess, so yeah. I must I'ma come later. I mean I'ma see you later. Bye bye.